This is Wilt Chamberlain, one of the best centers of all time and one of the best basketball players of all time. I decided to put him on today's Golden State Warriors roster to see what would happen. And as you can see literally here right off the bat, passing it to Steph Curry, 4-3. And I'm sure there's going to be a lot of those this season for the Golden State Warriors. Yo, what's going on you guys? It's KG Presents back here with another video. And today I'm here in NBA 2K24 and I want to see what would happen if Wilt Chamberlain, yes, the great Wilt Chamberlain, was put on today's Golden State Warriors roster. If you're ready, I'm ready. Let's get into this video and let's see what would happen if Wilt Chamberlain was on this roster. So obviously this team's still very good. Obviously you got Steph Curry, of course, Clay Thompson, an older Chris Paul, Draymond Green, Wiggins, you know, so very solid team. Are they a championship contender? Probably not, but you know, with the addition of Wilt Chamberlain, which is exactly the position that they meet, because they literally need a center compared to every other position. And I'm not saying Looney's bad. I think Kevlon Looney's a pretty solid center. Except, you know, compared to Wilt Chamberlain, you know, of course you're going to take Wilt Chamberlain. Wilt Chamberlain is one of the best centers of all time. So, I uh, here I am, Wilt Chamberlain, 7'1", 275. He's on the Golden State Warriors roster here. And let's see how the rotation is going to look here uh, this season. Not, I'm not pro proposing a trade. I am trying to see... Uh, how the roster is going to look. So we'll be playing him 38 minutes. He's a 99 overall. All these stats are good. I see Curry's going to get the next most minutes. And uh, yeah, I mean, look at this lineup, uh, starting lineup, especially Curry, Clay Thompson, Wiggins, Draymond Green, and Wilt Chamberlain. Still got Chris Paul coming off the bench. I mean, this is this is a pretty stacked lineup here. So hopefully the uh, Golden State Warriors can win the NBA championship. But anyways, let's get into this video. I'm actually going to simulate the first game here because I want to see how they do. 138 to 117 against the Phoenix Suns. Will Chamberlain had 43 points and 18 rebounds in his, I guess, modern day debut, if you want to call it that. Uh, Clay did not do good. Look at that, four points for him. But anyways, I'm going to simulate with you guys, and then I'll catch up with you all at the All-Star break, and I'll see you then. So here with the all-star team rosters here, Wilt Chamberlain is actually the all-star team captain, so good for him. And of course, we have Steph Curry on the all-star team as well, because of course, we're going to end up with Steph Curry. We are currently 41-7 and seven on the year. Uh, we're 24-3 and three at home, 17-4 away, 127 points a game, so we're doing absolutely incredible here. Uh, this is just such a good season for him. And the Warriors as a whole, Curry is averaging 28 points a game still with Wilt Chamberlain on the roster. We're going to check out uh, the player stats really quickly here. I'll do a full in-depth one towards the end of the season. But look at that. Oh, my God. 40 minutes a game. Wilt Chamberlain, 34 points and 15, almost 16 rebounds a game. I mean, that's what you get. I mean, let's see. What is the highest amount of points he scored this season so far? Um... He, I, he didn't score 100. He scored 49. I see that's pretty incredible. I mean, this man's the only player all time to score 100 points a game. Anyways, uh, good season for him. Good season for the Warriors. I'll catch up with you guys at the end of the season. And we'll go over the stats in more detail. And potentially the Warriors will be going to the NBA Finals. Will Chamberlain is your MVP, of course. 34 points, 16 rebounds a game. He also shot 16% from three. I didn't know Will had that kind of range. Good for him, I guess. Um... Victor Rookie of the Year. Chris Paul still wins Sixth Man of the Year. Uh, Will also wins Defensive Player of the Year, so good for him. And that's pretty much it. He's also on the All-NBA First Team, and he's on the All-Defensive First Team as well. So it was all around an incredible season for him. Check out all the player stats here really quickly. I just want to see like difference in variation. Right, so we just saw uh, Will stats right there. Curry still averaged 27 points a game. Five rebounds, five assists. He's still incredible, as always. It's Steph Curry. Uh, Clay Thompson had 17, which is pretty still solid for him. Wiggins had 15. Chris Paul had 14 points and eight assists off the bench. That's still a very good season for him. And, uh, yeah, I mean, all these guys still did pretty all right here. Uh, Draymond, honestly, you know, he still did his thing. You know, the rebounds and assists are always there for him. Yeah, it was a good season for us. We went 71 and 11. I honestly thought we were probably going to at least break the all-time record. Uh, which I was set by the Golden State Warriors a couple years ago, but I think, you know, we're still doing good. Look at the lead we have over the Grizzlies, 22-game lead over the second seed. So anyways, we're going to simulate now to the NBA Finals, and obviously I expect us to win. I don't see why we would not win. Oh, brother, this guy stinks! That's shocking to me. We lost in the first round to the Los Angeles Clippers of all teams. How do we lose to the Clippers? This is ridiculous. No, <laughs> we lost every single game here. Dude, I guess, I, I don't know. I guess the bench, I mean, look at the, this after Curry here. I mean, no one else was really doing anything. So I guess that kind of makes sense. But anyways, I hope you all enjoyed the video. Be sure to like, subscribe for future content. I guess even still adding Will Chamberlain to the roster here, I guess the Warriors still can't even get out of the first round. So, 
Got some rebuilding to do, that's for sure.